to COVID now, and 2021 ends with a, another round of record numbers of COVID cases for the day. And this has New York's governor extending the indoor mask mandate and making new vaccine rules for some college students. CBS 2's Dick Brennan has more tonight. As New Year's celebrations coincide with an explosion of COVID, health officials fear things could only get worse. I hope people do uh, stay cautious and keep their guard up, meaning, you know, please keep masking even indoors, even when you're, you know, amongst friends and family that you may not live with. And as we ring in the new year, we rack up even higher Omicron numbers, 76,555 new cases in New York State and a 22.5% positivity rate. We're breaking records every day. In New Jersey, there were 20 28,512 new cases. The Omicron tsunami, I think we've been calling it. Both governors are looking to stem the tide. Murphy visiting a new federal test site and Hochul announcing that she is extending the mask or vax requirement for businesses for two weeks until February 1st and requiring CUNY and SUNY students to get booster shots before they return for the spring semester. What would you say is the major health concern right now for health officials? The main concern is that so many people have still not been vaccinated. And with 2022 upon us, many are concerned about what we could face next from COVID. Are we at the point where we're just going to have to learn to live with some form of this virus down the road? That is the, the big question. Will we ever be in a position where you can go to the theater or fly a plane without wearing a mask? I don't think anyone knows. Another headache for the new year, the flu. Doctors say it's once again surging. Flu is up 600%, you know, than it was a couple of years ago. So I'm just worried that, you know, a twindemic could be catastrophic on the healthcare system. So doctors say it's more important than ever to get both your COVID and flu vaccines. Dick Brennan, CBS 2 News.